pleasure type thing. Does that peak right there have a name? It's interesting. That's Beckwith. Beckwith? You know, it's interesting to watch her from last year pulling the team up when I first heard her. Yep. Was pulling the team up. And now, when she's more relaxed, she notices more things. Like that little stick across the thing that she was like, Ooh, what was that? You know? So that's, <laughs> all, that's so good for her. Yeah. You know, to see this stuff because normally she's just like a freight train up here. So she misses half of everything she's walking over. Yeah. Hence, that's why also I have a new girl take the time to feel. Mm-hmm. You know, and that also, it really heightens our intuition, our wisdom, when we're feeling. Because, you know, even, you know, our senses, and that's why I said feel with your senses, because we actually feel before we think. And, um... And when we smell something, we feel what we smell way before we actually smell it in our material bodies, you know? That's one of our oldest, oldest senses. It actually is smelling something that you, like, physically can't smell. You actually are, your body's feeling it before. Mm -hmm. Your heart it actually is. You know, Hmm. So, you know, the first cell upon our conception is the heart cell. The first organ, the first physical part of who we are is the heart. And the heartbeat is what we are created from. The signature sound of you is the heartbeat. And surgeons know there's one little piece, one little spot within the heart that they do not touch. 